Hello and welcome to this pit stop for Bye Bye Black Sheep, designed by Torsten Langsvoy and published by Jolly Thinker Games. Bye Bye Black Sheep is a 30 minute card game for two to five players in which all players are attempting to gather sets of three or more of the same card, uh, player number depending on how many they need, and cards come numbered one to 16 and they depict different animals. On the player's turn, they're gonna take cards blindly from other players' hands. They can choose any player around the table and they lay it next to the watering hole. And the vast majority of cards are gonna depict animals and the player may continue going for as long as they wish to or until they hit one of the special cards. When a player decides to stop, they then pick up all of the cards from the watering hole. They subtract two from the total number of cards they took. That total they may put into their zoo face up. These are their scoring cards and this is where you're trying to get sets of three of the same and the others will come into their hand ready for other players to take on and we move on to the next player. Now there's a push your luck element to this because every player will have a black sheep in their hand. And if you draw a black sheep from another player's hand, your turn ends immediately. They get their black sheep back to them, but you must just pick up these cards and put them directly into your hand and nothing gets added to your zoo on this turn. There are other special cards, however, you can draw from players' hands and see if they've got anything useful for you. For example, if you draw the eagle from a player's hand, you may ask them if they have a particular type of card, and if they do, they must add it to the watering hole for you. For example, let's hear, I could say, do you have a number seven, Sean? Unfortunately, he doesn't, and we just carry on playing. If I draw a mole from another player's hand, I get to look at their hand of cards, and then I get to take one of their numbered cards, not one of the special ones, and put that directly into my zoo and carry on with my turn. Once a player has started with three different types of animals face up in their zoo, or two players have got the same type of animal going on, the thieving magpie card comes into play, and if you ever take that out of another player's hand, you may take a card out of the zoo and put it into your zoo directly. There are three more special cards you can bring in for what is termed an advanced game. If you take the white sheep out of a player's hand, they immediately get to play a card down into their zoo. If you take the mother sheep from a player's hand, you immediately draw another card from the stack and that gets added on. Or if you draw the wolf from player's hand, what happens is all of these cards get played face down in front of that player and they're gonna get added to their hand for the end of the game. The game ends, again, player dependent on whether you, once one player has collected five, four or three sets of three of the same animal. This has been a pit stop for Bye Bye Black Sheep. For more videos like this, check out the Game Pit channel on YouTube. For more in-depth coverage of gaming, please find the Game Pit podcast.